How y'all doing today? Y'all all right? In uh, Luke chapter 17, uh, starting around about verse 4, uh, Jesus was talking to his disciples about, you know, if someone sins against you uh, seven times in a day, uh, and, seven, and seven times in a day, that person turns to you and says, I repent. Jesus said, you must forgive them. And so uh, as Jesus was sharing this with his disciples about, you know, how regularly they must forgive, uh, the disciples said, oh, increase our faith. We, we need our faith to be increased. That's my paraphrase. That's not how they said that. But in verse five, the apostles said to the apostles said to the Lord, increase our faith. Give us more faith. They felt like they needed more faith after what Jesus said about forgiving folk and how regularly they would have to forgive people. And so Jesus responded to their request to have their faith increased. He talked to them about the mustard seed, the, the, how small the mustard seed was. And then once it's planted and nurtured, that this mustard seed grew up into a large tree. And he said, if you had even this small amount of faith, you could say to this mulberry tree or this sycamine tree, uh, be uprooted and be planted in the sea and it would obey you. So Jesus was saying, if you had faith, which they have faith, which they have faith because God has given all of us the measure of faith. He said, even a small amount is sufficient. Amen. Praise the Lord. Even a small amount of faith is sufficient to move mountains. Jesus said, you can say, you can say to this sycamine tree, to this uh, mulberry tree, uh, be uprooted and be cast into the sea. And Jesus said, all it takes is a small amount. And he says over there in Mark chapter 9, 23, he says, if you can believe all things are possible, all things are possible. We can move mountains, the word of God tells us. With our faith, we can speak to mountains. We can move mountains. There's no such thing as faith that doesn't work. It's God's faith. It's faith God has given us. So it works. There's no such thing as faith not working. Faith works if we work it. And as we see here in Luke, Jesus is telling his disciples, his apostles, it just takes a small amount. A small amount of faith is sufficient that it will get the job done. Faith connects us to receiving the blessings. Faith connects us to receiving the miraculous. Faith connects us to receiving answers to our prayers. Faith is the connection. Well, you say, Sister Sonia, how do I use my faith to move mountains? We see right there in scripture, look at Mark chapter 11, verse 22 and verse 23. It says, have the God kind of faith. Have God's faith. Use the faith that you have been given. Start right where you are doesn't matter how small it is. But Sister Sonia, how do I use it? You speak. That's what the word of God says. You say. Jesus said, and whosoever shall say to this mountain, whosoever shall say, regardless of your amount of faith, even if it's a small mustard seed, listen, it is sufficient to get the job done. But we must use it. Whosoever believes the word of God says the impossible is possible to even the one that believes with just a small amount of faith. Whosoever shall say. That's how. That's how you move mountains. You say. You speak. You use your words. You use faith words. Regardless of how small you may feel like your faith is, look at the truth of what Jesus said to his apostles. He said, if you have faith the size of a mustard seed, even a small amount of faith, even a small amount of faith is sufficient. So let's use our small amount of faith 
and let's get the job done and let's say what we need to say. Let's speak to what we need to speak to, to get the job done. Amen. God bless you.